because he was trying to make some point level call. I give him 6.5. I didn't, I saw occasional uh, defending there, but I didn't see much from him. The crossing from the left uh, flank, uh, actually, wing back is not his uh, uh, desired position, and so I would accept that. And uh, the, let me come back with the issue of Chelsea before I continue the um, ratings. Uh, normally, I, I have problem. The issue I have problem uh, with uh, the issue I have with Todd Bolly and clearly Capital is that um, uh, they needed to have consulted before taking certain decisions when they bought Chelsea. And when you look at Roman Abramovich, I'm telling you the reason why Abramovich was successful. Though the reason for this uh, video is the ratings. I'll come back to the rating just briefly. Roman Abramovich appointed Jose Mourinho, who won Champions League with um, FC Porto. So he had a winning mentality coming into Chelsea. And so that was why Abramovich started on a successful note and Chelsea started winning trophies all of a sudden. And when you look at Manchester City, when the Sheikhs were in from UAE uh, bought the club, they went in for Ferran Soriano and then uh, uh, Tiki Bejiristan and uh, Pep Guardiola. Later on, they brought Pep Guardiola. They did it at Barcelona and they have that winning mentality. You see City now winning trophies. But Todd Bolly came to Chelsea, he went to Brighton and uh, uh, employed Paul Winstanley. You see, later on, Lawrence Stewart also joined. And then Joe Shield uh, had some academy experience. You know, all the uh, people we have at the head of recruiting, uh, the head of recruitment for Chelsea, they are not winners. They manage mid-table club, which is Brighton. And some also had stint with City Academy, Joe Shield. You see, all these are, are not enough to make Chelsea to win. So that's why Chelsea is a mid-table club. Because those running the affairs with respect to recruitment have, have mid-table mentality. So until Todd Bolly appoints some people who are winners, I am not saying he either sack all of them or he appoints someone who is a winner to add to them. Because I, as I said, I'm not bragging. The work that these people are doing, I can do better than them. Because we are at mid-table now. You see? We need to get people who know how to win. And the recruitment model that was even put into practice, though somebody will say, we, the fans, are hypocrites. We were delighted with some of the signings. Yes, but... We wanted this uh, uh, period to come. You signing player is one thing and the player doing the job is another thing. And we know this period will come and now we are struggling in mid-table. So we need to, by proving experienced players in January, to improve our fortunes. Let's come back to the ratings. Let's go to Moises Kaisedo. Moises Kaisedo.